Welcome, everyone, back to the Pharaoh's Cup. We've got myself. My name's Power Bang. I'll be hosting the show tonight along with Mustache Dave. I'd love to see these players continue to sign up for these community events to really showcase their skills here. It's been a fan favorite for sure. Let's dive into the scoring and how the rules will go down in tonight's action. As you can see on the left with the placement points, oh so elegantly arranged in a pyramid formation. Thanks, production team, for that. Oh, oh, we're going for the oh, punch no. out. Oh, 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 oh the machete. Oh, 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 no, no. He what? didn't just do him like that on camera. He didn't just do him like that on camera. Dave, tell me no. Tell me no. Okay. Wow. Talk about a wipe right there. Two wow. other points on the board. Walud in one magazine just eliminates a duo, wipes them right off the map. The synergy and the teamwork is just, it's just on point. And that right there to show you, you know. Mafia taken down, Dream with the immediate support. That's 10 points in total. So if you could walk out of Picado early game with 5e limb points, that's equivalent to a first place finish in placement points. Swapping out over to that UMP, looking for some jump shots over here. I like the SKS play though. I mean, the 7 6 too, that thing packs a punch if you can connect. It doesn't even matter though. Looks like Kermit able to finish that one. 6e limbs here. For Team 32. Uh, on Team 14, Anya's been consistently at the top of the... Well, never mind. Just taken out. Anya just died. Three minutes. Three minutes into this. Oh, wow. Well, they, they pulled up, and that's exactly what started the chaos over here in the Cathedral. Almost immediately, these teams here in those vehicles pulled up, and they just started to push each other here. Dream heads over the wall. He's just going to push straight in. Gets one knock. Going for the flush, but he's gonna find some friends. Oh, hey, he's gonna, just, gonna take him out. Not Maybe only pass uh, off the uh, heels. Bro, oh, bro, bro. no, not like this. We saw not it too. Not like this. <laughs> not like this. Oh, Scooby. Reviving? Nah, give him your heels. No, just pass man. Off the heels. This is tough. He's out of heels. He's gonna revive him, and now what? You guys are both gonna die. Looks like Walker going that spray down, swapping on over to M4, but the vault over the wall. Slowing them down just a little too much right there. And they're going to be taken out as now we got 12 teams to go. Almost within that money when it comes to placement points. Taken out from Zombie. It's up to Toxic Trick to seal the deal against Zombie. Zombie going for that spray down. Zombie with the double UMP clutch right there, Power Bang. That was huge, Dave. That was a really, really nicely played uh, encounter from Zombie. Kind of botched, though, on the opposition side. They split and went for the uh, the the push onto Zombie, but just ran out completely exposed and allowed a 1v1 two times in a row. Oh, there's the support, Dream wow. said, with the UMP. Wow. And there's the double. There's the double. That was incredible. Looks like he's going to smoke out Mafia and get him all the way back. I mean, look at this. This is an incredible play from Dream. Great heal. Drop oh. shot, not successful. And GSR able to get the victory. GSR 99RG picking up his fifth frag of the match. Whether you're 25th place, it does not matter because it all reforms tomorrow night. And we got to look at this motorcycle <laughs> yeah, one accident more one more time. This yeah. is all the way, I believe, from the first game of Group A. <laughs> and we've been looking at it almost every game. The Wolves out here, Power Bank, in first place here so far. Oh, you, you love it. So the Wolves, all of these teams are basically picking a, an animal as their mascot. The Wolves as Team 24, and again, TBE Max gets smacked immediately. And now it's up to, to Dream to try to figure out like where these guys are. He's pre-firing, he connects and drops two. Malik oh! are struggling. Look at this. Waka with the 1v3 power bang. Are you kidding me? He had almost no health left over and he is going to get the finish on Walud. So my goodness, what a great little finish there. Anya really, really strong off angle here. Firing from the side, taking down Bear, getting that finish and fall an enemy taken down as well by Ruby. Solid play here from the Wildcats. He gets knocked. Look at the flank coming in, but it's Fallen Mafia who's playing the clutch card. It is the reverse, and he is able to get in and get some pickups here, and you know who he's going to pick up first. It's his boy, Dream. That boy, Dream. Ah, seemed to work pretty well, and they're still going to be 
in it. Look at the amount of people that are currently not on the map. It's not often in PUBG Mobile that you see the remaining amount continue to climb. Yeah, uh, definitely uh, interesting in the charms. Wait, oh, 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 <laughs> there's more across the street. 16 oh. and 19 are over there. Oh, dream though. Oh, wow. Able to get that heal off. But they are at the disadvantage just based on numbers. Ooh, that volley was nice right there in the corner. That spread just a little too too far. Calicar out here on the outskirts trying to pop this heal. Noob AF burning alive. Oh, wow. Calicar also burning. The Molies just too strong right there from the side of the Jackals. Looking at that mini-map, look who's approaching them actually down there below. That's going to be the Barracudas, that red team, just a little to the west side of what we're looking at right now. The Raptors on the hilltop here. So this is first and second place. This is for all the marbles, Dave. Yes, yes, it is exactly. That's where I was going with this. Like, they're right next to each other here. They are indeed. You can see Psycho starting to peek the windows here for the Raptors in your top right. Got Shamwar, one of yesterday's chicken dinner winners, snaking around in your bottom right. And then FG Payne put the hurt, putting the pain on the Falcons at the top of the ridge there. They're just trying to hold this compound. And I feel like they're just trying to be big and noisy and loud here for the Barracudas. They have closed oh. the oh, Psycho, bro. There's fire literally on the ground. Still alive. Oh, Psycho, done. what are you doing? Everybody's burning. Everybody's burning in the smokes. They don't what? see it. Bro! <laughs> Who? Did the Mustang just, just win? Psycho! And then ISL Wonka. The strong performance super early, but again, waned off in the later games with still a, an extremely respectable 29 eliminations and 4,700 damage to Wonka's name. So that was crazy. Ooh. Look at that. The Wildcats did it. Woo-wee! That's an I incredible course. comeback. Yeah, nine points too. Really solid uh, difference between third and fourth place. So that was a, a solid final match from the Wildcats who have been consistent all night long. Up here, guys, there's so much going on in the PUBG Mobile universe. So let's celebrate the champions of the Pharaoh's Cup. We've got the Raptors. Look at that X suit. Are you kidding me? Dave, Amazing. are you kidding yeah. me? Look at that uh, thing. I'm, I'm jealous. Uh, right now, I'm the Wildcats. Like, that's me right there looking over there at the Raptors. Like, how, how do I get that upgrade, right? And then, of course, Barracudas, second place here on the podium. All three of these teams, an insane amount of uh, just just uh, action that they had all night long during the six matches. We had three on Aragorn, three on Miramar.